In tonight's What's Working, an Eagle Scout project in our area has gone high tech. He created a new app to improve the visitor experience at one of our local landmarks. News 5's Devin Wall shows us. Inside the brochure, you're going to have a brief history on Fort Gaines and a map. The past. Or you can go to your app store, download iTour Fort Gaines. Has now merged with the future at Fort Gaines on Dauphin Island. Tourists here travel back to the time of the Civil War. And a new app is teaching them about dozens of important parts of this historic site. From start to finish, we're about... 22 months in. St. Paul sophomore David Brown created the I Tour Fort Gaines app for his Eagle Scout project. I just wanted to do something that was really going to impact uh, my community more than just building a couple benches. I wanted to leave a lasting impact that people would know and use for decades. You'll open it up and then there's a huge green play button. David took us on a tour of Fort Gaines. You click play, it'll start playing the audio. Using the new app. It allowed access to the gun platform for soldiers and ammunition. Also located here is a chest high serpentine. We crisscross the fort. These two islands mark the boundaries of Pelican Harbor. Learning Confederate history. Which was named during the early 18th century. Along the way. Their beds were not as good as our beds today. They didn't have cotton. At just 15 years old, this Eagle Scout put countless hours into building the app. David says he created the app because he wanted visitors here at Fort Gaines to experience what it was like to be a soldier here during the Civil War. And the app does that. Tourists like the Star family from Tennessee let the app give them a guided tour. We use it for the whole entire time. I don't know how the trip to Fort Gaines would be the same without the app. It was awesome. The free download has only been available for a few weeks at Fort Gaines, but it's getting great reviews. Once we tell them that uh, the app was created for us by an Eagle Scout, they feel the need to have to come in and talk about how great it is. I just feel a huge sense of accomplishment knowing that uh, these people are using a uh, tour system that I made every single day. And thanks to David's project, tourists will have a greater learning experience at Fort Gaines for years to come. For What's Working with photojournalist Arnell Hamilton, I'm Devin Walsh. Brown has to raise $2,000 for the cost of the app and for some improvements he wants to make at the fort. If you're interested in helping, log on to WKRG.com and look for Devin's story.